Welcome to the dialogue, learning from the masters. This podcast will offer you a rare glimpse into our in-depth interview with screenwriter Nick Kazam. What do you think prepared you most to be a screenwriter? Just going to movies. I just love movies. I mean, I never studied writing. Uh, I never studied screenwriting. I, you know, I didn't go to film school. I just, um, you know, it, I hear voices and I see visions. And instead of being locked up, I'm a screenwriter. You, you picked the, the, the good option. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> um, do you think it's possible to write towards being commercial? Is that ever a consideration in your work? Or do you just kind of let the chips fall where they may? If I'm excited by two ideas, and one feels commercial and the other doesn't, I'm more likely to write the commercial one. But, uh, you know, I, I met with um, Alan Horn a year or so ago, and he said, you know, people talk about commercial, but it's impossible to predict what will be commercial. You know, I mean, if someone pitched you the idea of a beautiful mind, would you think that was necessarily commercial? You know, in the right hands, done in the right way, an idea can be commercial, or, and the same idea in the wrong hands, done in the wrong way, no one will go see it. And so, you know, I think that the, the most important thing is to, is to write something that you passionately believe in, that you see really specifically. And be true to that. And be true to that. And if you can do that, then other people will respond. And, you know, the most unlikely thing could turn out to be very commercial. This has been an excerpt from the dialogue Learning from the Masters with screenwriter Nick Kazan. To get the full interview on DVD, go to the dialogueseries.com. There you will find this and all 27 in-depth interviews with the industry's leading screenwriters. You can also find these interviews at Netflix, Amazon, Audible, and coming soon to iTunes.